Civil society groups are saying that they have no confidence in some of the projects conducted in Sri Lanka through the Information Communication Technology Agency or ICTA. The situation that has arisen surrounding the Google Loon project and details emerging of attempts by a private company to obtain the spectrum has given rise to doubts over projects that are being carried out by ICTA under its CEO Mohundan Kanage. According to the website of the Information Communication Technology Agency or ICTA, several projects have been initiated covering different sectors to promote information communication technology in the island. These projects include the Government Data Center Initiative, the Consolidated Centralized ICT Solution for the EPF and the ETF, the ESAMURDI Integrated Welfare Management Program and the National Security Operations Center, which is a forensic and cyber security infrastructure development project to be implemented across borders. This is not just a matter of national security, but turns out that this program also contains a plan to swindle away the country's employee provident fund. This company has also signed an agreement to merge the EPF and ETF and develop an IT system to create access to find information. So it's not just a matter of the EPF, it is also a matter concerning national security. They have signed a number of projects. The balloon which went up crashed, so if that is the case, they must tell us what the next step is. Where is the free Wi-Fi? The Google Loon project that was carried out in the country under the CEO of ICTA, Mohundan Kanage, was also unsuccessful. With the involvement of the Rama Corporation being revealed, civil society organizations allege that the project was an attempt to obtain the spectrum of the country. We saw the balloon going up and it coming down. Whose money was spent for these projects? How were the finances spent? Who is empowering these? Who is responsible? Is it ICTA? Who wasted the power with that agency? Where is the transparency? If you think you can do projects for the sake of your happiness at the expense of public funds, then that is a serious issue. Carry out an audit on the expenses that were incurred. We are requesting this under the right to information.